RCB Auction has been in existence since 1985. We're their first and only auction house with license. It's actually quite exciting. You know, it's like in the movies that you see how people are raising their, the fans a bit for the items. And we have people from, from different countries, you know, from, mostly from this region, but also Westerners that live in this area come and to look at our items and bid for them. We have two auctioneers, one speaking Thai and one speaking English, and it actually goes quite, quite fast and quite exciting. RCB Auctions at River City, Bangkok hosts monthly auction for collectors. The auction house also conducts grand auction every quarter. The first grand auction for 2017 will be on Saturday, April the 1st. Uh, grand auction, the quality of the goods will be a special auction. There will be about 300 items for grand auction. So, in the category, there will be a lot of items for the collectors. All the items are certified by the Association for the Propagation and Promotion of Obchase Dart, established since 1979. ในงานประมูลเนี่ยบทบาทของสมาคมคือรับรองบราณวัตถุผ่านใบเซอร์ติฟิเคทของสมาคมว่าของชิ้นนั้นเนี่ยตกอยู่ในช่วงยุคไหนต้องเป็นของที่มีอายุเท่าเกณฑ์ที่จะเป็นบราณวัตถุตามที่กฎที่ยอมรับกันในสากลต้องหนึ่งร้อยปีขึ้นไปเกณฑ์ในการกําหนดราคาเนี่ยเราจะรู้ราคาที่สมเหตุสมผลของของแต่ละชิ้นนะครับเพราะฉะนั้นบางอย่างเนี่ยเราใช้ประสบการณ์ในการทำงาน32ปีเนี่ยเราใช้ค่าเฉลี่ยคร่าวๆอยู่ประมาณนั้นประมาณนั้น This cigarette case was once owned by Frank Sinatra and now it's up for auction Highlighted items for this April 1st grand auction are cigarette cases Marco Fabeche from private collections of Frank Sinatra a silver gold Niello cylindrical teapot from Ratanakosin era and Benjerong vases painted with Thepanum and Norosing designs, Benjerong covered soup container, and Benjerong bowl, all from Ratanakosin era. What you can see is that the quality is the need of the people in Thailand and other countries. So, when you get to the day, it's about the need of the people. The need of the people is the need of the people. I think antiques is actually also a way of investing in the people. I think antiques is actually also a way of investment. Uh, preserving your wealth, especially during t this time when the interest rate is so low. Actually, a lot of people are looking into investing in antiques, even the arts, you know, because in the future they do appreciate in value. So it is actually a very good time to learn and invest in.